Okay, hi, welcome, welcome back. It's been a long time recording for me, but we're back today. We're playing some more Red Dead Redemption. I'm really excited. I know last time I was a bit down. If you saw my community posts, some stuff has been going on. That's really quick. Okay, so we have a few missions. We have, who's this? Irish, which Seth told us about i believe we have another west nigel one and we also have bonnie one bonnie's one now although we're closer to irish i do want to do bonnie's because we haven't done bonnie's in a while oh we also have a seth one too okay let's go do bonnie's one so i know last time also i said um it didn't say american appetites complete but it actually did i just didn't take notice of it saying that so um i'm not sure if that entire quest is complete yet because we obviously we killed the cannibal but i was still very confused as to who was actually doing the killing um i really couldn't make sense of that. I know this game is kind of known for its like wacky, crazy kind of NPCs, but I really just could not understand what was going on there. I was struggling to comprehend it, but yeah, I still don't know whether the entire quest is completed or not. Oh, you just you just spawn in. Okay, it's very pretty. It's like is it Twilight kind of sky? I think. Oh, dime! Dime! <laughs> I was trying to work Dead Eye. I was trying to work Dead Eye and it didn't work. Damn it! Okay, my waypoint's still set. I'm kind of thinking though, maybe we should just go do Irish's. Wait, no. Oh god. There we go. Come on. God, the amount of wild horses here. Crazy. Let's go. Let's go. I love his voice. I don't know what it is. It's just such a nice accent. Let's go. Pardon? Oh, there was a skunk or something. Hi! <laughs> Dang! John! Oh my god, there's a head there! <laughs> John! Now. We're getting a load of money though. Let's see what you got. What is it with this place and bones? Okay. Where's my horse? Okay, so we got some more money for that. Got some ammo and fame. Always lovely three things. Armadillo. Blow it up now. A Frenchman, a Welshman, and an Irishman. Oh. Oh. This was not what I was expecting. You missed it properly this time, didn't you? You little paddy bastard. You thieving mick cunt. You got it all wrong, Welsh. All wrong. It was French, I promise. He said he was going to rip you off. Now he's ripping me off. Here, keep on talking there, Irish. In about 15 more seconds, your whole world's gonna turn black. <laughs> What's up, boys? <sighs> Fuck off, boy. This <laughs> concerns you. When a man with a sing-song voice tells me to fuck off, it always concerns me, boyo. <laughs> Look here. 
This petty bastard <laughs> stole our guns, tried to steal our horses. Lost clear on the matter. I never stole nothing, sir. Never did. Not in all my life. That French cunt is playing with the Welshman's tiny and ineffective mind. Push your mind. <laughs> anyway, you all got horses now. No one needs to die. Leave him be. Who do you think you are, boy? The bloody <laughs> cavalry? <laughs> Voice is really starting to get on my nerves, boy. Oh, I know it's on my nerves. Yeah, <laughs> you smell oh, like the wrong hell. No, but, mister. no, 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 wait, wait, let's. Uh, your old dumb fault for befriending this Irish turd. I don't want to kill the Welsh guy. <laughs> okay, the first guy I ever liked was Welsh, so I kind of have just have like this, like. Thing about Welsh people that I love plus um, I've been to Wales I love Wales there's a place in Wales that I just absolutely adore I don't want to take out the Welsh guy also if you see me looking over here it's a habit that I got back into I, it's really bad I need to stop I'm not look I'm not live like this is being recorded I'm not looking at a chat or anything I'm looking at myself to make sure I'm in frame because I also have this thing where I tend to slouch and it's really bad for my posture. <laughs> so I'm just trying to make sure I stay sitting up straight. So if you look, see me looking over here, I'm not like looking at chat, I'm looking at myself. Basically I'm a narcissist, <laughs> but yeah, that's what I'm looking at. I really don't want to take out those guys though. Why you make me do such thing? It's very rude game. Very long loading screen as well, apparently. Did they not checkpoint me? You reckon that fool of Irish is what you had for? Oh, I'm sorry, Welsh boy. I'm getting good at this. A Mr. Nigel West well. Dickens said you'd help me locate a machine gun. And since I just saved your life... Oh, I can't thank you enough for taking care of those two degenerates. Uh, untrustworthy, poor in personal hygiene, lacking in the finer qualities of a, a gentleman. Uh, what about the gun? It'd be my pleasure. She's magnificent government issue. It'll be a bit of a ride, but we'll get there soon enough. Uh, follow me, fella. Sorry, sorry, but the best. Let's get this over with. The saloon's <laughs> calling me. This is turning into a hell of a day. I still have this issue where I try to slow down. What's your name, friend? The other guy just speeds along. John Marston. So I just have to press A to match color. the speed, otherwise it doesn't work. <laughs> Who are those fine specimens of humanity? They were the only friends in the world. The boy am I glad to see them back for dead. We all met on the boat over a few years back, we did. Come on, do you want this gun or not? Take his knees ever since, and that's right there was the problem. Is it normal for friends in Europe to drown <laughs> each other? Never trust a Welshman, me pa always told me. And he got his throat slit, so he should know. I the killed an animal gray, okay. From a blind cow, and then kick her for squealing, and ask for that French bastard. He didn't sound very French. Ah, for now, me. the thieving bastards are hoard up at the cabin by the lake. Can't wait to see the look on their faces when we blast them. You see what I mean? Like, I can't slow down. When they're first porcupine. You best because they just be speed me. along. Listen, fella, I just it's incredibly annoying. I don't owe you nothing. Well, you kind of do. decide what you do and don't owe me. I've had enough of your overly aggressive manner, fella. You don't know who you're dealing with here. Babe, you don't know who you're dealing with. I love how much more bold John is in this game. You can make quick work of those fellas if they give you trouble. The gun's stored just inside that chat. What about you helping me out? Uh, I'll cover you from the ridge. I'm better from long range. It'll be a piece of cake, fella. Trust me. Why do I not believe you?
Is it only this guy? Anyway, say, bit of a setback. <laughs> Nothing unusual these days, apparently. Ew! I realized I need to go check out the store. I don't really do that. You had him from me. There you go. Oh, that didn't get you. Okay, I need your machine gun, sir. So if you don't mind dying, uh, make it both easier for us, I guess. I don't know. It's not here. That lion sack of shit. Oh my god. That little rat. Okay. <laughs> Where did it put me? I feel like we're oh wait um well not that far. Sorry, there's a sticker. We're not that far. Let's wait. I'm actually gonna get him to sleep just so it's daytime, and then I'll get him to do Bonnie's mission. Yeah. What the hell is going on here? Why are there so many? Wait, sorry. <laughs> Are you good or bad? Here, take all the money. It's yours. Please, don't kill me. I'm confused. Anyway, let's do some looting. We got honor for that. I don't really know who they were, though. I thought she was being, like, captured or something. Damn, y'all have a lot of horses. <laughs> oh, wait. It's not... It is still not time. Thank you very much. Let me go. Oh, damn it. Oh, okay, fine. Hopefully by the time we get to Bonnie's, it'll be light. And if not, I can just sleep there. Can you not go so far? Thanks. I'm still trying to get used to the Xbox controller. It's very weird still, obviously. Oh, I'm used to the PlayStation controller, so using the Xbox One is very weird. I don't think I ever realized how much I'd miss haptic feedback. It's crazy how much I miss it when using the Xbox controller. I know I didn't have it with Red Dead 2, but there is still like a lot of games that I play that when it doesn't have haptic feedback or when I'm using the Xbox controller or even when I'm using keyboard and mouse I don't realize how much I've actually missed the haptic feedback. I know some people don't like it but I think it's one of the best things about the PlayStation controller. I don't know it's just fun and I guess it adds that more that much more realism into the game which I love. Oh. I'll bet you money. Twelve dollars. Oh, fine. Why not? I like watching a man eat. Kill three birds. Dying. Get down here. One, two, three. Three. See, that's how you do it. Ain't that something? All right, here's your winnings. Uh huh. 
You shouldn't bet on me, mister. I'll take your feather. Okay, so we started a new challenge. That was fun. God, never thought I'd hear myself say that. That was fun, killing birds, shooting them down. Oh wait, is that Fort Mercer? I think that's Fort Mercer. If it's not, that's gonna sound very dumb. I'm still trying very hard to get used to this map. It's very weird. Everything pretty much looks the same. I'm gonna lie. Like, I feel like in Red Dead 2, each place was very distinctive and different. So it was easy for me to tell where I was or round about, but here I'm just, everything's the same. And maybe that's just because I've just started playing it basically. But I don't know. I don't think I've ever realized how much I'd miss not playing Red Dead 2. It's very weird. Let's go. Like, I always wanted to finish it because I wanted to know the story and perhaps that's why I not rushed through it but didn't spend as much time on it as I wish I had. And of course I can always go back into the world but there was just something so yeah. lovely about experiencing the story for the first time. And I really wish, I really wish I could, I would experience it again for the first time without knowing. Because I really miss it. I really loved that game. I really did. I don't think I realized how much I'd love it or how much I grew to love it. There are some, obviously there are some qualms about it, but it was so much fun. I loved playing it. Okay, I'm gonna get him to... I think that's one of the things though about games. That's like one of the sad things. You can't ever experience the game again, um, which is also kind of in a game of horseshoes. Ooh, where is that? Oh, it's back here. Um, I think that's one of the reasons why I love doing this though, because if I ever wanted to, experience a game again for the first time and I couldn't, I can literally just go back and watch my reaction of it. And then I pretty much, although it's not exactly the same, it's pretty, pretty similar. And so I'm lucky in that sense. Can I play the game, please? I wanna play. Okay. Tossing a horseshoe is controlled by the point of release. You can send a horseshoe further by choosing a lower release point. Okay, so we have to try well and get done. it in there. You can find you the distance by pulling your arm back less. Damn. Okay, to toss a horseshoe, push RS up and down. You can aim left and right. <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> Wait. I didn't mean to do that. Okay. I'm so confused. Oh, oh, I thought it said hold down. Damn it, I'm so bad at this. <laughs> I'm, oh God. Um, yeah, let's do $1 because I'm just horrible at this. We're playing for money, great. Here's to losing all my money. Well, maybe not, depending on, don't get this, don't get this. Come on, you're trash. There we go. Very nice. Did you just say very nice, John? <laughs> Why is he on this side, John? No. Okay, that should get it. Hmm. 
Đỡ và Okay, I think that should get it. If I can do it. I know what I did wrong. I don't like that no more. I don't want to do it. No, thank you. I'm gonna go see Bonnie now. I'm gonna go see Bonnie. I've been traumatized. Um, hi. Hello there, miss. Why, hello. No, I'm traumatized. I lost my game. I, I was so excited to play it, and I'm so bad at it, and... Why, hello. It's just so sad. I'm gonna sell these. Thanks for the visit. What can I buy? Hmm. Do I really need anything? I don't know what these are. I don't have enough money anyway. Thank you for uh, buying my stuff, sir. There's a bounty poster. Uh, I kind of want to go to Bonnie's mission, though. It's herding cattle again. I don't want to do on, this. I changed my mind. Can I go back? Hey, miss. I'm got so most sorry. Of the horses secure and the chicken. Well, thank you, Amos, but it's the herd I'm worried about. I know they're scattered all over the valley and beyond. The weather is coming in real fast. So what do you suggest, Amos? We leave the herd out there to be scattered by the storm and ourselves left here to die without a livelihood? Can I help? No, miss. If the men get caught out in that storm, they're gonna die. And if we lose our herd, we'll all die, you stupid man. Doesn't sound like we're left with much of a choice then. Come on, Amos. Round up your men. Let's get the herd. Dang. Jesus. Come on, Mr. Marston. Hurry. Okay, so now I uh, hate Bonnie. I'm officially a Bonnie hater. This guy don't look good. I'm starting to think somebody up there is conspiring auntie. against me. Are you a religious man? Not in any real sense. Sometimes I tell myself things happen for a reason. Like what brought me here was fate come a calling. But nobody made my path for me. We all need to look for answers somewhere. Some in big old books, others in big old bottles of whiskey. Believing in some kind of divine purpose ain't gonna give me my wife and kid back. Past is who we are, Miss McFarland. There ain't no change in that. Wait, have they been Faith taken? I can't afford. We have two herds out. And that's why he said practice. only uncles we'll on the farm, them because they're not back. actually there. I think we can handle that. Because the they've been taken. Real ornery in bad weather. And by killing and Bill is the only way them. he can get them back. Be able to hear each other in this rain. Just make sure you don't lose oh, okay. <laughs> ah. Hmm. Well, okay. <laughs> I'm guessing this is a cattle. Maybe not. I don't know. Bonnie. Bonnie. Oh, I just killed the bunny. No stopping! Let's go! I haven't seen a storm like this for a while. We need to be quick. You little rat, you get back here. Get back Come here. On. Go. Back. God, he's so hard to steer. Oh, you little rat! Get back! Go! Let's move here, my four leg friend. Oh. I swear to God, if one more of you go, I'm gonna scream. We still have to get them back to the ranch, though. My abhors can go only go so fast. Yeah. Yay! 
yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 you know that. Bonnie, I killed all the cows. Good work. I thought we'd lose them all. I, I killed them all. I literally wait. What? I killed all the horses. Though. I mean, I'm not complaining. Thanks for like reviving them for me. Really appreciate that. But I still killed them. Come on. I am returning to the herd. I've got to get this lone cow. Come on, cow. Stay I don't need screen. I have no friends to show. Balmany, come on. Let's go. Come on. Pick back now, y'all. Okay. Move ahead. Can you shut up, please? Back to the barn. 16 out of 21. Wait, so I killed. How many did I kill then? Five. Not my fault, y'all uh dumb. Move on, no. move on. Why am I the only one doing this? Do I have you paid my debts by now? What was it? Fifteen dollars? I have nearly three hundred and fifty. I can pay you back. I don't wanna do this anymore. Can you ah! John Get back. No, wrong way. get these guys back to the ranch. This is actually painful. You dare wander off, I Come swear on. to god. Move it up. Get a move on. No! Another one. No stop. Let's go. Move. Move. Come on. I actually can't do this. Okay, yeah, I've got to get them all in there. It's not going to be that easy, I know it. Come on, I can't do this all by myself in this weather. The weather's getting worse. Get in. That was so painful. <laughs> Close you up the gates. The back there. You might make a decent rancher one day. I already you, am, Mr. man. He's trapped in there. Whoops. Sorry about that, buddy. Okay, so we have another Bonnie mission, then we have yeah. the Seth, we have the Irish mission, and West Nigel. What to do next? Well, it's raining. I kind of want to sleep. I think that's poker. Should we try poker? I don't know. I'm going to be bad at it. Good to see you, my dear. We have to get them people off that land. Harley bears are Pete and do it. We can give it a go. Oh, ten dollars? I'm gonna lose all my money. My money. Oh, I got. Oh, I got four hundred dollars. Oh my god, golly gosh. I seen the bar dog water down the gin. Oh my god. Every round starts with a false bet called the small blind. The person left of the gin must bet half the min minute. What? You are dealing Texas Hold'em Poker. Each player will get two cards followed by five cards that everyone shares. An 
Betting the same amount as minimum bet is a cool. Where'd you hear that? I'm confused. <laughs> I'll put it out there. Choose how much to bet and enter it with A. If you don't like your hand, fold. I'll raise you. I call. I don't know. I don't know poker. The first three cards are called the flop. This is followed by a round of betting. Okay. Now I'm either lucky. When the minimum bet is zero, a player can check. This I'm means they will bet nothing. On a job. I can believe it, though I might not want to. Betting establishes the minimum bet. The next player must either call or raise the bet. I'm so confused about all of this. You scared or something? Folding the hand is giving up. You forfeit all the chips you have bet so far. Okay. Price? I don't know. Really? The fourth shared card is called the turn. This is again followed by the round of betting. Now that's more like. I'm gonna call it. The fifth and final card is shown the river. This is unfolded by the final round of betting after which the cards are shown and the winner is determined. This is going one that? in and out the other. <laughs> Fold. Too much for me. How are you doing? This here is a real nah. frontier. Yeah, I'm gonna quit. I got four dollars. I bet ten and I lo I, I lost six basically. Okay. I don't get that. <laughs> kind of want to go to Bonnie again. We're here. If it's another herding one though, I'm actually going to stop. The burning? Oh. Oh. Excuse me, Mr. Marston. Have you seen my father anywhere? No. He went out this morning to ride the land and was supposed to be back hours ago. I don't know. The ranch hands have been out looking, but so far they've found nothing. Well, come on, let's go look for him. Come on, let's see if we can find the old goat. <laughs> Something tells me he's gonna be banning. I don't know. I feel like he's dead. Just I've got a small bad guess. feeling about this. It's not like him to be away yeah, for so like long. Yeah, I feel like he's dead. Don't worry, we'll find him. He's not as young as he used to be. What if he's hurt himself? Father can still handle himself just fine, Miss McFarland. Oh, like you said I should read You're the newspaper. Right. I will give that I can't a help worrying. after this. He's all I've got. Don't you have any brothers or sisters, Miss McFarland? I had six brothers, but five of them died, either from sickness or foolish Yeah, choices. he said he and buried more sons. He left for the east children. and never came back. Must had. be getting on for ten years ago now. He's a high and mighty banker in New York, according to his last letter. He should be here, helping you and your pa. I don't want his help. He can live his life any way he wants. But when I see those city fellers coming in on the railway, all dressed up like a sore toe, I fear a little for his soul. He switched his saddle for a tie, and that's fine. I just never met a man in a tie I could trust. Who's that over there? Well... Yeah. Sorry, I feel like now is not the time for jokes. Daddy, what happened? Nothing nice. Wrestlers, I guess. I mean, he's not dead, they which is surprising. But now you head back to the ranch right now. Fetch your wagon. Yes, there sir. are dead people. Marcy, you watch after her. I'll do that, sir. I don't want to, though. Come on, idiot! What could have happened to those poor men? And the horses were dead too. I think we should get back there as soon as we can. Who could have done something like that? Your boss seemed to have an idea who it was. Let's just do what he says and get the wagon. Didn't he literally just say it was full of things that we've encountered a bit? Those damn rustlers! I've got a good mind to head over to Pike's Basin myself. I don't think that's a good idea. And you're no better. How many men have you killed? Why do you is this really want to know? That's to disgusting. me. Disgusting. You never met the men I killed. I heard the way you talk about that gang you were in, like there was some twisted morality to what you did. I was forced did. into we it. We all have a code. Only some of us don't realize. The outlaw it. with the code? 
How wonderfully romantic. The reluctant murderer, the noble criminal, there's nothing. I mean, I get why she's coming from. Man. Okay. Found a way but... to think the bad into good. You're upset. Oh my god, the barn's on fire. I I thought the smoke. Come on, boy. I thought I noticed the smoke, yeah. It's annoying how it's cutting off the dialogue though, because I can't slow down because the cheese stops is very frustrating. But over it, John. Los caballos. There's no way in through the front. Oh, why is she just standing there like that? <laughs> Try and get in through the loft, Mr. Marston. Climb up the windmill! The windmill that's on fire. Oh. Sorry, John. Come on. Whatever y'all do, you can't use fire because I'm I can't swim. Get a move on. Where does it want me to go? This ain't working. Oh, up here. And the barn's on fire too. Why am I climbing down? Oh my god. Oh, I guess we're gonna let out the horses or something. Yeah. I mean, I don't get how the, the top of it is on fire and the bottom isn't. Well done! But... Now let's save the horses! Oh god. Not the horses again. Sorry. It's not funny, I know it's not funny. It's okay, come on, come on. It, it kind of is funny though, I don't know. No, John. <laughs> this way. Go look. What happened to Bonnie? Bonnie? Is she dead? She's not dead. You sure know how to handle yourself. No. Okay. Thanks, Marston. Yes, John. Thanks. You she mentioned well, you something about choking, and I was like, excuse me, I, I got chores thought she to died from the fumes. I was gonna say it's pretty hold weak. I went in there and Sincerely, did whatever, John. but okay. Thank you. Well, did all I could, Miss McFarland. Damn, y'all ain't doing good. I'm not gonna lie. The gang seems to really want you out of here. Yeah, well, my father fought Indians. I scarcely think we're gonna be frightened by some white trash. White <laughs> trash can be pretty frightening. Well, they don't frighten me. Good. John, my family owes you. Yes, a great you do. Debt. I think you got enough debt. You saved my life. All I ask of you is this. If I get back home and get my farm started back up, you'll sell me some cattle. I prefer doing business with people I know. Of course, Mr. Marston. So wait, what's It'd Uncle doing then? Um, well, you get some rest. I've got to go see how my father's bearing up. Well, we got some more fame. Um, who to do next? Who to do next? Oh, we have another Marshall mission. Put it away. Hi. Excuse me. <laughs> what? You little rat. Oh, should we go look at the patrol? Go. <laughs> Thanks. Quickly load in this so I can't. <laughs> so it can't get me, basically. Follow Charlie. He's a good one to sniff out trouble. 
Stick next to the dog, mister. Oh my god. Lasso and hogtie criminals or stop them by any means before morning. Okay. Where are we going, buddy? Aww, this is actually really nice. <laughs> Can I stop going around in circles though? Wait, Charlie's the name of the dog, right? Yeah. Kind of feel like it's glitched out. Honestly, everything in this game, the amount of glitches I've had in it, kind of makes me feel like if anything doesn't happen, I feel like it's glitched out. <laughs> run into quite a few glitches which is very surprising considering in the ps now version i didn't run into one so i don't know pretty weird not gonna lie sorry doggy Take it later. <laughs> Damn, this dog road can get fast. Watch your step, partner. John, I'm not gonna lie, you ran it. Oh. Come on. Wait, I, I I keep forgetting how to. You curious to see? this fun? You little rat. <laughs> Let's get it done. Why am I so bad at this? It's not even funny. It's actually really bad how bad I am at this. Where does it put me to? Okay. So those two are pretty close together. So I'm thinking maybe we go do Marshall's next. Wait, there was a Seth one too though. Oh, Seth's down here. Let's go do Seth. I miss Seth. Let's go do Seth then. I, I, I don't know. I really hope Seth doesn't turn out to be, I'm not doing that night patrol right now. I'll try it again uh, in the future, but not right now. Oh yeah, newspaper. I don't know. I don't know if it's still. Oh no. Okay, when it comes up again, I'll get it. But I don't think it's here right now. Wait. Le uh, wait. Let me check inside quickly. Good evening, sir. Good evening. Good. Good Oh, can we get a train ticket? No. Hmm. Oh, it's getting dark. Wait, let, let me go back and I'll sleep because I don't want to keep doing things in the dark because then you can't really see. So I'm going to go back and I'm going to get some sleep. Hello, are you Charlie? Oh, so cute. Why are they all partying outside my house? I do not appreciate that. Uh, yeah, let's put that away. I'm gonna get some sleep. Oh, I'm gonna get him to get some sleep. And we will go do Seth's mission. Nope, it's still dark. I mean, it's nice that we can save it, but I kind of wish we didn't have to. Um, if we just wanted to sleep. But, <laughs> I don't know why I'm complaining. It's like a good thing that I'm saving it. I need to save it more often. Do you see how many times I die? I'm excited to see Seth again. I love Seth. I don't know. He's so... I feel so bad for him. As I said, I am now his protector as Charles once was mine. The world's been passed down. I've been promoted, basically, is what I'm trying to say. Ooh. I hope you're not about to jump off, sir. I know who you are, Marston. Hello, John. John Marston. Oh. 
Hi. Do I know you? I hope so. I seem to know you. You kind of look like Trelawney. You're remembering faces, are you? Do you remember Hattie McCourt's face? Who? She was a girl Dutch Vanderlyn shot in the head on that raid on the ferry a few years back. Same one you got shot on. Pretty girl, until her eye was hanging out by a thread of tendon and her brain was plastered over a wall. Not really. Then why would you remember me, friend? You've forgotten far more important people than me. We didn't play that, right? What's your game, friend? I don't have a game, John. Listen, sometimes I just wish I'd known more about life. I wish I'd had better guidance. A friend of mine, he's drunk as a skunk in the <laughs> saloon on Thieves' Sorry. Landing. I think he's going to be unfaithful to his dear wife. Why don't you head over there and see if you can advise him how best to proceed? What do you think I am? I know what you are, John. Just if you've got the time, friend. He's having his main character for a minute. Okay, we'll go do that. Um. One thing I never understand, though, is cheating. Like, okay, fine, I've never been in a relationship, but I just, I never understood the concept of cheating on someone you love. Like, why would you do, why? And you can't say, oh, you know, I got drunk, it was a mistake. No, I'm 100% sure if I love someone, I wouldn't cheat on them because I love I wouldn't want to hurt them. It's not even that, like, the fact that, oh, I wouldn't want to hurt them. Why would you want to be with someone who isn't the person you love? Come on. Like, you put all that effort and all that love into loving this one person, and yet you go cheat on them? If you're going to cheat on them, just break up with them. Like, it's not that difficult. It's so frustrating to me. Like, it, ugh. God. Oh no. Oh no. Can I back out? Oh god. Oh god. A gentle drive. I for some reason I don't think it's gonna be gentle. Set. Mm, yeah, hey no. John. Hey partner. Get what you need? You ready to help me? <laughs> Not quite. Not quite ready. You see, I wasted a bunch of time looking for that last bit of map. And I got to thinking, Moses was a liar. And I imagined myself doing all kinds of unpleasant things to his corpse. <laughs> and then I realized. You realized you were sick in the head? That you needed to move on with your own limited time on Earth? No, oh partner. God. <laughs> I realized Moses weren't no liar. Oh. The issue was Aiden O'Leary, who said he had the body. Aiden died in that flu epidemic, and the bodies weren't even buried yet. I, I, <laughs> got the body sitting in the back of that wagon behind you? Yes, sir. His hands. You're not even going to wait until they're buried before you... <laughs> well, they don't care, do you, boys? Honest folk, off to a better place. Apart from that Aiden O'Leary fella. I never liked him. They say he lay with his sister. I don't like women, partner. I don't... You're gay? Not since Mammy died. Oh, your wife? Seth. I'm... You Seth, babes, you have issues. Like, it's okay, everyone does, but... You need to explain I'm a bit more clearly, because I, 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 I don't understand what's going on. I need the map, partner. I need it. I think we should be getting out of here, partner. Why am I driving the wagon? <laughs> This is pain. All right. With the cow hunting. We can search these sleeping beauties. Drive southwest towards the secluded spot. Okay. Can't you go any faster? No, right. Fine, you drive. God. If I just want to enjoy the day, it's a nice day. Look, it was raining yesterday. I had to go into a burning down barn. Everything was a bit hip to do, y'all. To the left. We don't want to roll through town with these bodies. Where are you? Come on, don't 
What did you say? I didn't say nothing. Are you talking to them? So what if I am? I think he's talking to the map. With them than in a crowd of people. The way I see it, they lost their souls, just like me. You're truly a sick man, Seth. And you remind me of why I hate people. For a man who kills so much, you sure seem to have a problem with the dead. Life kills everyone in the end. <laughs> they ain't so different from you and me. Aside from them being dead and rotting, I guess they ain't. All right, Seth, calm down. You talk to the corpses and I'll drive the wagon. I'm not gonna lie, this probably wasn't the best quest to choose out of all of them at the moment. <laughs> Definitely could have gone ahead and chosen a better one. This is so hard to see. I'm actually surprised. Oh my! It's them damn treasure hunters! Try and outrun them, partner! Oh god. Fast as you can, partner! I'll search these bodies as we go! Can I just kill them? Just going on a little trip. Damn, nation! Keep them horses, damn it! So, I guess this is goodbye. Oh, dying. Tracking the bodies hey, one by one. Right. Betty's got something on it. Where's my map? Come on, whisper to me. Well, look at this. Some elixir. Oh my, oh my. Is this the quickest you can- I am trying, Seth. We're gonna have an issue if you keep complaining to me. What are you, donkey? Come on now. Play nice, my lovely. This won't take long. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Money where you're going, friend. Can't you see we're in a rush here? This Keep is extremely hard to do. We gotta go faster, partner. Okay. Uh, should I take some we're sitting ducks. medicine? Let's go. Work them horses. Shh. This will all be over soon. Go left here, partner. Sorry, I'm terrible at driving wagons. See, we're one big happy family. Make a left! Yes! Here it is! I've got the map, mister! I got it! I got it! Oh my, oh my! Looks like the trick of the tumbleweed! That's where I was headed! Keep going! We're almost there! Come on, let's get this wagon moving! Can't you go any faster? I can. But I'm busy killing people that want you dead, apparently. And want the treasure map. One of the two, I don't know. It's either or, to be honest. Shut up! I keep forgetting about the horses summoner, too. My bad, my bad. I really love the music in the game. Seth, baby, you've got a bit of blood on you. That could be either yours or the corpses. Month of searching. I'm gonna be rich beyond my wildest dreams. Maybe then you can take a bath. <laughs> Thanks, Mister. I reckon I'll sit here a while trying to figure this out. I'm gonna be rich. When you're done with that, get over to Fort Mercer. I need you inside that place. After I find my treasure, mister. Somehow, I don't think that's gonna happen. I'm not gonna lie. What do I do with the wagon? <whistles> Seth, babes, what are you doing? Okay, well, let's leave him to that. Uh, next on the list. Oh wait, so, oh yes, that's right there. What's horse breaking job? No, no, we are not doing that. I'm sorry, no, no, no. 
I am not doing that. I'm not putting myself in that position again. That was horrible. I hated every moment of that mission. It was bleh. Let's go. I'm just, I don't do well with cattle and horses and lassoing. It, it's just not me, okay? It's just, it's not me. Nothing I can do about that, to be honest. Let's go. Let's go. Oh my good golly gosh. That's so funny. I I've had so many people say like, oh, I've never ever heard anyone say, oh my good golly gosh before. And I don't actually know where I got it from. I think I just picked it up sometime because I thought it sounded sudden. Um, whether it is or it doesn't, I don't know because I'm not sudden, clearly, because my accent is too bad for me to actually be sudden. And we're back to this place again. Okay. Man, man, man is born in the trouble. <laughs> Oh no. Excuse me? <laughs> Was he dreaming? I see you. Get away from me. Right here. Get away from me. Oh, he reminds me of Machine Gun Irish. Oh, Mr. Marston. I, I found one. I don't believe you. Found us one, Irish. We're in this together. You, me, and an assault on Fort Mercer. But I'm the guy that saved you from getting killed okay. back there. And who you owe your life to, remember? <laughs> Not really. It happens to me all the time. <laughs> all the time. You don't want it to happen to you again, do you, Irish? I can do it Your myself. And I want to buy you a drink. I want to tell you how much she means to me. How huh? special you No thanks. And I want to tell you that if you don't produce a Gatling gun within the hour. You'll wish you'd been killed back there. <laughs> it's the whiskey, sir. <laughs> Joe Marston. It gives me the memory of a newborn babe. As innocent as can be. Don't... Oh, John. Jesus. And it makes me violently angry. <laughs> Shall we go look for that gun, sir? <laughs> yes. Let's do that. Let's do that. Not a feller to give up easily, are you? Have you met me? Of course not. Is he fit to drive? I don't think he's fit to drive. Drive? <laughs> Horse ride, whatever you call it, I don't know. Ah, uh, for some reason, I know this might be a wild guess, but I don't think he is in the right state of mind to horseback ride. Although he actually seems to be doing just fine, so that is surprising. Why do they ride so fast? God. We're never gonna get that gun of yours if you keep messing around. I'm not doing nothing. I love me faithless Flora. The lily of the wind. You're not God. gonna pass out on me, are you Irish? <laughs> me? No, I'm right. He's gonna rain. pass out on us. <laughs> or at least somewhere stuck between air and Madlin. Well, you're gonna be stuck somewhere between dying and dead if you try to cross me again. It's worse like that at all, feller. The intentions were pure. I swear it on me poor mother's life. I just get a tad confused from time to time. Honest mistake. If there's any more confusion, I'll finish what your friends in Armadillo started. Jesus, you're an impatient bastard, aren't you? Where's the gun, Irish? I hear some miners been blabbing about a machine gun they found. Apparently, they got it stashed up at Gap Tooth Breach. What do miners want with a machine gun? Shoot it at somebody, I suppose? Or sell it? I don't know. I've never been down a mine in all my life. Sounds real fishy to me, Irish. I have. Well, just about had it with so. you and your game. Better that fun. Not fair now, Johnny. We should go around that the side gap to the miners don't see us coming. I still don't know what miners would want with a machine gun. Miners are always fighty bastards. Spend too long without daylight and doxies, and it starts playing with your mind. I never heard so much shit come out of one mouth. <laughs> I'm telling you what I heard. Oh, and we'll need a wagon or something to get it out of there. That gun's heavier than sin. So how was I supposed to move it by myself last time? You two-faced little bastard. I had a wagon. I left it with Seth, though. Here we are. Here's Let's me all this time with a of like an SMG. Not like an actual, like, pew, 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 machine gun. God. Okay, my bad.
I was like, oh god, we're going to have like an SMG room. The no. entrance is plain to see, and there's a shaft them bastards no, we're not. to pull out heavy ore. We, I mean you, can use that lift to get you and the gun to the surface. No, you're coming with I me. I do it all myself, but the mines play havoc with these sinuses. I'll find us a fine place to hide these horses. Yeah, somehow I don't believe you. With a borrowed flat wagon. <laughs> Call me crazy. I'll meet you at the mouth of the mine shaft. And Irish, I strongly advise you don't run off this time. You're just gonna try. John. You must be lost, cowboy. This is private property. Intruder! Take cover! Bam. No! No! No, the horse! Not the horse! Ah! Target the horse. <laughs> okay, I've d I discovered a new outfit. Lovely. <laughs> We're not losing the horse. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, actually. Oh God. <laughs> Oh, dying. I'm taking all these guys out by myself. Babes, that's a bird. You don't want to shoot the bird. There are so many. Nah, boy. That guy. This is where we come from. What is that song? Do you want to reload your damn gun? The hell are you? I am Mr. John Martin, thank you very much. God, oh god. Are we good? I'm gonna hope we're good. Casual looting quickly. So I hope you're not still alive. <laughs> okay, one more body. God, that sounds really bad. I'm going in by myself. I'm also going to get him. Oh, my health is. Wait, why did it say max? I'm confused. Oh, did I pick up some? I don't like that noise. This Ooh, 
Oh wait, is that? Oh no, no. it's just a little bar. should revert back to my pistol, but... Oh god, I'm on fire. What, what was that though? That was like a growl. John... <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Oh, wait. They're done. There's one down there. And one up here too. Hello. Wait, let me go back to this one. Makes it very smooth. I should heal. Oh, I already have. Wait, what? I've literally been taking so many shots, though. I like the enthusiasm. Y'all need to learn some manners, honestly. I don't go around sh shouting rude things when I'm killing you. So why why would you do that to me? I should I I need to heal now. <laughs> Wait, no, let me heal first. Not heal. Let me loot. Very important part. Damn it! God. I forgot how annoying a fringe was because you just like constantly see it and you constantly feel it too. <gasps> I can still loot, thank god. Thank goodness. Somehow I feel like this is gonna be very tricky though. Okay, so. Do I stand? I'm guessing I stand this way. Why would I need to stop? go this way instead then I can't get any other way
No, wait, that's going back. I'm so confused. I can't get it going down this way. Oh wait, this doesn't lead anything. I don't think I... No, I have to go this way. I really thought that would have worked. Maybe we're supposed to go the other way. I don't know. I can't get through that though, so... I don't think it is this way, but it's literally the only way I can go. What are you doing? Oh! <laughs> Wait, that's so cute! Because I swear this leads back out to the other side, but it said lead it to the shaft run, so... I don't know. Sometimes this game isn't clear and perhaps that was just me being dumb. But with the TNT behind it, you couldn't expect me not to think that I had to explode that part. Why do I feel like he's gonna pull Rumpelstiltskin and run off? Yeah, he's saying bye. Oh wait, no, we're up. Okay, fine. Fair enough, fair enough. I doubted you, fair enough. I admit my wrong. God's own gun. Ain't that the truth? I got us a borrowed flatbed parked down below. Meet me at the bottom of the hill! Okay, now what way do we go? I'm guessing that way. Oh, that's why it mentioned enemies. I get it. This is getting real nasty. Oh! <gasps> Oh god, oh god. They don't need to die, friend! This is actually fun though. Apart from my, my whole mishap of not knowing where to go, this is fun. Whee! Nearly there, Charlie Boy! Charlie Boy! Let's go! Let's go! Shortly <laughs> right now, and we'll have this executive peacemaker delivered to Old West Dickens. Mm. Okay. Just make sure it doesn't fall off on the way. Okay. So, <gasps> oh, there's a stranger, funny man, and there's another one over by Irish, okay. Yeah. Let's, I feel like I'm doing these missions in a weird order. I feel like I was meant to do West Nigel's first, then do Irish, and then do uh, West Nigel's again. Because I feel like that whole thing was another mission with Wes Nigel's, hence why he took it back to him. Let's go. I don't know though. Oh god. 
I I hope that didn't take me back too far. Oh no, the mission's gone. Damn it. That's wait. It didn't even put me back there. Okay, no. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm going to fast travel back there. I don't care. I'm gonna set my waypoint. I'm gonna get out my basic campsite and I'm gonna fast travel to that waypoint because that's not fair. <laughs> Granted, do I feel like this is kind of cheating? Yeah, but it's so far away. <laughs> Damn it, it's dark. But there should still be a side mission. Horse, come here. Okay, I'm gonna ride my horse this time. You little rat. Let's go up the stairs this time. Wait, is it downstairs or upstairs? You know what? I think it's downstairs. Because the arrow is pointing down. Can I get in here? Do you think? Jonathan! Okay, I need to find a way to get downstairs then. Don't hurt yourself. How do I get downstairs? Oh my god, that's a snake. Oh god, don't bite me. You little rat! I knew it was gonna do that. I knew it was gonna do that. Vermin. I should have got the snake oil. Whatever it's called. This is a messy one. Ew, it looks like a worm. Okay, how do I get back down? Clearly I can't drop down. Jonathan, don't you dare. Oh God, John, John, John. Okay, I thought I would be able to maneuver him over to the side. Clearly I can't, clearly. I don't know how to get underneath her. I think I have to go back through the mine's entrance thing. Okay, if I follow these tracks, uh, I should be able to get back into the mine, I believe. So I'm gonna go back up to where like the whole thing is, and then I'll just follow the tracks back. Yeah, so if we follow these... Oh. That should have led me back into the mine. Wait, that's lowering it. Can I get in it now? When it drops down? Oh. Yay! Okay. Saves me from having to find the mine entrance again. What was that scream? Oh. They're hogtied, okay. Please tell me there's like a thing that I can use to redo it and get back up. I appear to be in something of a bind! I know. <laughs> Jimmy, <laughs> I didn't know you were a miner. I'm not, sport. This is the first time that I've ever been underground. But I like getting a preview of being buried. It Wasn't be he fun, the, 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 the poem Your guy? The wind is wasted on my dumb western brain, sport. Oh, don't worry, you're not missing much. I'm beginning to think that this article will be better written on a tropical island in the arms of a beautiful <laughs> maiden. Like Tahiti. Idea. Now, can we get out of here? Yes, please. Go on. Don't worry about me. My apparent ineptitude is just a comedic aspect. Wait, how do I get out of here? I'm gonna follow him. I'm hoping he leads me to salvation, because, dude, I have no clue where to go. It's 
still love their runs. Oh, yay. We're out. Thank you, Cancer. Now, where's my horse? And I... Th oh, there's a container. I hear a dog, too. Oh, God. John, 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 John. Jonathan Marston. I'm gonna call him Jonathan. Okay, let's go do stats now. Let's go! Let's go! Whoa. Oh, there he is. Puffy is running into the sunset. <laughs> oh my god, what was that? See, it's, it's kind of weird because obviously I knew I knew Red Dead had the six chapters and then obviously the two epilogue chapters. But I don't know how this game is. Like, I'm pretty sure there's not chapters in it. I'm pretty sure it's just like one open world game with side quests. There's nothing to kind of tell you that you've completed a certain part of it, if that makes sense. So I kind of have no clue. Um... But I really want to go see the ranch. I want to see how it compares to the one in Red Dead 2. And I want to see Abigail and John. And actually, I was informed that um, this Abigail is played by a different voice actress compared to the one in Red Dead 2, which is really interesting. But I'm also like one of those people that do doesn't like change really at all. Although the thing went. <laughs> so, although essentially... Um, this change was in Red Dead 2, it's weird for me, because I played Red Dead 2 first. Let the dead bury their dead. I, I, oh, I why like do that, I keep choosing it? to do Seth's I'm one at the moment? Seth today? Oh, the old silent treatment. Oh, whoa. Oh, oh. That's quite a stink. Hey, Seth. I think you're smelling yourself, Seth, buddy. come back here. Oh, hey, partner. I was just looking for you. Looking for me? What? Over there? How you doing? I'm good. Well, uh, what has he done? Where are you going, partner? Nowhere. <laughs> okay. Nowhere wouldn't happen to be where that thing you're looking for is kept, would it? No, sir. <laughs> no, sir. Come on, partner. Okay, I was just uh, fooling. Partner, uh, Seth, you know, my love, come treasures. on. Funny things to me. According to the map, it's somewhere in that big abandoned house. That one? The mansion? Okay. Oh. Bye. Seth, you're not gonna try and kill me, are you? Please don't say you are. Because if you do, we have a big problem. I don't want that. I love you, as I said. Oh my. It's an ambush! Oh my god, oh my gosh. I thought it said this was. Done at the moment. Oh god. god I have to hide. I'm trying to hide. Oh, I can't. Look, I figure they must be with you. Oh, you gotta shoot somebody. I'm trying. Where's the other one? I like him better dead. I'm gonna keep bugging by you. this just great? What? In tarnation? I'm gonna cut you so clean! You sure about that? Uh, yeah, you might be actually. It's mine! I found it! Okay. I believe you. Give me a second, let me you don't oh, ever look find it. this. Damn nation! Thank Stay close! What's Think this you one? Walk in here? Oh that Why have I not been using my shotgun? I'm so dumb. I need to move closer. John, you are so annoying. Do I have no ammo? 
Oh, I have ammo. Why wouldn't he shoot? Jonathan Marston. Do something, mister. They're gonna take my treasure. I guess it's too late to talk about things. Thank Someone you. might as well have this. Try around the back. Oh. Please! Before they find it! Babes, they're all dead. Come on, Seth. Maybe. I, I don't trust myself now, actually. <laughs> I'll die him. I thought you were Seth. I dropped a hundred fools like you! I doubt you'll be needing this. That's it, partner. Focus. Blow their damn brains out. You can't kill us all, you fools. Okay, oh, things are really starting to fall apart. This can't be happening. Jonathan. Who's speaking? Don't leave any alive. Bitches. Damn it, John. That one almost got me. I'll be rich, boy. I had it with you, bastard. If it ain't me, it's someone else. Oh god. Come on. Don't torture me any longer. Get over here. Yeah! <laughs> Finally, I see the light <laughs> at the end of this very so long, see long tunnel. <laughs> Seth's gonna be rich after all these years. <laughs> Maybe open it first. It's silk sheets and Parisian whores from now on, mister. <laughs> it's it's empty. Oh. I'm sure whoever that belonged to treasured it very much. <laughs> oh, he's so smug. Stupid liars. Those stupid chicken shit maps. Make it a damn fool of me. It, it happens glass to the best of us. <laughs> it's a glass eye. Stop with the tears and help me with Williamson's gang. And you can come up with another excuse to go exhume one of your old friends. I'm Put sorry, sir. This treasure ain't done me no favors. Sure. Sure. Oh, I I'm just realized we go by that. <laughs> I'll see you and Mr. West Dickens over at Fort Mercer when you gentlemen is ready. Okay. So I'm guessing we're going to be collecting him. We're collecting people. We're just picking them up one by one. Um... I'll take you. Can I explore this place? No, I think it's pretty. Oh. Oh, when I say that. Oh, a container. Money? I'm a bleh. I, I mean, not bleh, but. <gasps> we got a pardon letter. Okay. Good things, good things. Anything else for me? What the hell? What? What went on here? Wait, what was in this room? 
Uh, wait, what? Oh, I climbed over the wall. I could have just gone through the door. <laughs> This reminds me of like House Beneviento. Okay, where is my horse? I'm guessing this is like an abandoned cow. What? Oh, we're pretty far away. I'm probably gonna. Can I? Yeah, I'm gonna get him to fast travel back to Bonnie's so I can go sleep there and save. Do you have a destination? McFarlane's Ranch. Ranch? Ranch? We don't have another Bonnie mission. <laughs> we don't have another Bonnie mission as of yet, do we? I didn't see one, so I don't think we do. I think we have two West Nigel missions to do though before we go ahead and do. Actually, I'm gonna go to the doctors really quick and I'm gonna get some more ah, How are you, medicine. Good deal for each of us. Do I have to get him food? Howdy. Howdy. I don't know how this works. Done. That'll do me. Okay. Uh, and then I'm gonna get him to go to sleep. Good evening. Hey, good to see you. Good evening. <laughs> Sleepy time. Oh wait, let's look at the outfits. This is Marston's typical bounty hun clothing. We have wearing this high class attire that allows you to into the high stakes poker game in Blackwater. We have these ones too. Oh, that one looks cool. Oh, so do we have to collect things? So we unlock outfits, but we still have to like collect them. Okay, no, I like this one. So I'm gonna keep this one. <laughs> Save, please. Thank you. I appreciate it. I'm gonna get him to save again because it's still dark. <laughs> we gotta get that good 12 hours of sleep. Thank you very much. It is still dark. Let's go 18 hours in. <laughs> 18. 8. 8. 8. 18. 18. There we go. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna leave that there for today. That was a long part. It was a lot longer than I actually originally had anticipated it to be, but I got really carried away. It was so much fun. And it was it was actually a really nice distraction to what's been going on. I know I said I'd kind of put this aside because I know it's a pretty heavy game, especially from what I played with Red Dead 2. But no, I am really enjoying it, but I'm gonna leave that there for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and hopefully I will see you in the next part of Red Dead Redemption. Okay, bye!